Hi, I am Valder Beebe. I am the host and the visionary of That Celebrity Interview. Joyce Tung, welcome to the Valder Beebe Show to talk about 23andMe. How are you? Good, how are you? I'm fine. I want my audience to know that Joyce Tung is Vice President of Research at 23andMe. So she has a great perspective on talking about genetics. Joyce, let's get started. Let me ask you, the role genetics may play in explaining the difference in severity of diseases. How can that be? Well, so we have seen that there, in past studies looking at different infectious diseases, that there are genes that are associated with the susceptibility to and severity of the disease. So, for example, we have found in other studies that genes associated with our immune system can be involved in influencing the severity of a disease. When um, one person, we'll say a parent has a disease and a child does a 23andMe, does that help to say your parents have this disease and you're more susceptible to it? Is that kind of how it works? Well, you know, parents obviously do pass their DNA onto their children. For so, for certain kinds of studies, um, that information is really valuable. Uh, for 23andMe, we are usually looking at large populations of people. And so for that, you know, really what we're looking for is just a lot of different people to participate. How do the 23andMe scientists, how do you use this unique platform to help find answers? And then what, what do you do with it when you find these answers? Right. So, you know, one of the nice things about our research platform is that people can take part in research from the safety and comfort of their own home. And so basically we take their genetic information and, and their answers to survey questions like, you know, have you been diagnosed with COVID-19? And we put those together to try to understand how DNA influences disease. In this case, you know, as soon as we find something out, we will publish it and share it with the larger community. When you give a person their results from 23andMe, and I've always worried about this because I gave one of those kits uh, to, to away for uh, Christmas. Mm -hmm. Is there any psychological counseling when you find out that you're susceptible to cancer or heart disease? Is there any support system for people? So, you know, we go through a lot of extensive testing to make sure that the reports that we give people are easy to understand. And then in addition, we provide links to resources to learn more um, and, you know, get more support. Okay. On your, on when you do your study, expanding the study, was there any studies going on during or about COVID-19? So we started off back in April with a study to our 23andMe customers looking at COVID-19. For that, we already have over half a million people taking part on the study. And over 8,000 people have told us they have been diagnosed with COVID-19. But since we're trying to understand severity, we really felt like we needed to have more severe cases, people who have been hospitalized and recovered from COVID-19. So we expanded the study to invite people who aren't even customers of 23andMe yet. If they've been hospitalized for COVID-19, they can join 23andMe at no cost to them and then take part in the study. COVID-19 seemed to have it, everybody thought it was just first a uh, uh, select group of people, then it spread out to didn't matter what age group or ethnicity, um, and then it started hitting children. Are children uh, candidates for 23 and 19? Because they seem to have a mysterious part of COVID-19. So our particular study is for people who are ages 18 and older. Um, but, you know, obviously there's a lot of work to be done still to under, better understand this disease. When a disease like COVID-19 comes along, and excuse me for staying on this topic, but it's just it's on so many people's minds. When a disease like COVID-19 comes along, do you guys feel that this is an opportunity for you guys to make breakthrough in genetics? I mean, I think we are very hopeful to try to contribute something to the effort. I think one of the things that's been really inspiring to me is to see how the scientific and medical communities have come together to really work together and accelerate our fight against this disease. This is more of a personal question. You guys do this research, and as researchers, has any of your team or any of your uh, company members 
been impacted by COVID-19, maybe a family member, and does that make you work harder when that happens? You know, I think we all know stories of, you know, people we know who have been impacted or had a family member impacted. So, I mean, I think, you know, we've all been touched and I think we all really want to contribute to the fight. I want to thank you so very much. My audience who wants to get COVID-19 tested, I'm sorry, excuse me, please, 23andMe testing, how do they do this, Joyce? So if people are interested in participating in the study, they can just come to our website at 23andMe.com. There's a link at the top that says COVID-19 that can tell you more about the study. Thank you so very much, and thank you for the work that you do. Thank you for having me. Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I host the Valder Beebe Show, broadcast on radio and television. And this is My Phone Pouch. My Phone Pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com. Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, host of the Valder Beebe Show. I have used Credit Help USA, the credit restoration company that's bonded and state certified. When you become a client of Credit Help USA, you become eligible for a set of stainless steel cookware from Credit Help USA and the Valder BB Show. Get your credit straight today. Visit credithelptx.com, click on the Valder BB Show icon, and get started living life divinely. Mm-hmm.